High traders 2018 began with a perfect 4-day 2.6% run of the S&P 500. The market rose despite disappointing employment numbers re released on Friday. One of the ramifications of such a move is the difficulty of, find ma of fund managers catching up. Their performance is measured against large indices, therefore it is very very hard for them to compete. In order to compete, they must continue to inject money into the market and the market is of course due to that very very high. So yes, the market is high, but we must continue to follow the trend and we must continue to buy stocks which are relatively cheap. We must look for these stocks and buy at any pullback. Let's take a technical view of the market. When I look at the S&P 500, I can see that the market uh, broke at consolidation of a few weeks and moved to a new high. So again, the market is strong, the market is moving higher. Uh, Santa Claus rally, just a reminder, is over, but as you can see, even after Santa Claus rally, which ended on the 3rd, the market keeps moving higher. So the trend is our friend and we must continue to follow the market. Let's take a look at last week's picks. <music> We had SYF for long from two weeks ago. SYF finally started moving higher. It is very, very close to our first target. Uh, a reminder, at 3% we sell three quarters. My second pick was LBTYK. LBTYK is doing good too, is moving up and again getting close to the 3% target. My third pick last week was MET short. MET did well to start with but changed direction with the market as the market was moving higher and is now very close to my stop loss. I never lose more than 3% so MET watch out for the stop at 3%. Let's have two picks for this week. My first pick for the week is NTAP long over $59, a very nice uptrend in NTAP, a very nice um, move to the highs and very nice technical formation for a breakout and also a move over whole numbers. Whole numbers are always very important, you find a lot of sellers at whole numbers so if NTAP, a software company from California, USA is going to move over $59, I'm very interested to go long. My second pick for the week is ICE. ICE long over $73 and again a whole number and again a very nice technical formation. The market's moving higher. If ICE is going to move over $73, going to look fine. ICE is an exchange of clearing of futures and stocks in the United States. You probably mainly, mainly know it as the owner of ARCA. So I wish you a great trading week and see you next week. Thank you for watching my video. Do you have what it takes to become a trader? I would like to invite you to take my free trading challenge. If you succeed, I will fund you. You will get free access to a $14,000 trading account which you can trade from home and earn 70% of the profits you generate. No risk, no cost. Just click here and join now. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel here. If you have any questions, please use the comments below.